<laughs> 30 minutes until ready. Right, if I put all the rabbits in here... It doesn't go up at all. So, let me... This pack is getting kind of heavy. I guess I have to harvest them first. Oh, I can do it with a, ha a hatchet. Hacking it apart. Inedible. Never thought I'd be dying from starvation. Why is it inedible? Was I meant to take it off at the right time? He's actually starving to death because he let his rabbit burn next to him because he was too busy cutting up the other rabbits. And yes, he did it, not me. Him. Oh, right, you know what? I'm just going to eat some stuff in the fridge. Fuck it. And then I'm going to go to bed, and when I get back... We'll figure this out in a second. I'm going to run out of supplies. Like, I'm missing a step here where I'm meant to get more. So I have to go all the way back to get more rabbit. Maybe I'm meant to... I don't know. Maybe I can kill a wolf. Maybe I'm meant to be wolf hunting. Right, how is it doing now? It's so far off! Oh my god. I fucking hate this woman. Yes, you. You right there. You just... Just cut your fucking... Ugh! I am so bad at this game. Uh, so anyone else who's just joined us, welcome. Welcome to trying to start a fire. Yes! Right, I'll burn for 30 minutes. What do I have to cook? One minute, come on. Come on, baby. Come on, give me the rabbit. Give me the rabbit. Five, five minutes until burned. Eat it. Wait, it recovers nothing! Oh my god, right, I'm going to bed. Fuck this. I could eat a horse. You know what? Just go to bed, just sleep for six hours, and just die. Just die of hunger in bed. I don't care anymore. Cool. I'm gonna need to eat soon. Yeah, I get it. You want the food, you fat prick. But we don't have enough. You can last for three weeks without food, you can last for two days without water. You've had your water, survive without your food. Survival tips from Brad. Now put your matches away, you're looking an idiot. How is she surviving? Like, I haven't seen her eat a thing. Just, just wait till I leave and then she's just scoffing fucking Doritos or something. Ooh, the floating mystery book. Worship the mystery book. All I can think about is food. Oh, shut up! Don't hear Grey Mother complaining. Why would I be given the instruction to go to the garage if there wasn't something useful there? I also have one more house over the far side on the left. I didn't check. It was next to the bank manager's house. Man, I really thought I'd get this done quite quickly and we can move on to what the next part of the story is, but it's taken so long just to find the food. Oh. Ooh, this is new. I can search cars. Maybe find stuff under the seats. Oh, shit. I guess it's a good place to hide from the wolves. Oh my god, I don't want to get out now. It's right fucking there. This was awkward. Alright, it's moving away. Nope, get in, get in. Okay, hiding in cars gets you away from a wolf. That's extremely useful to know. So keep walking, Wolfie. Just fuck off. That's a good boy. Uh, nope. No, no, you, you stay over there, Wolf. It's fine. Oh, here we go. Milton hidden cache notes. Hidden note. That sounds really close. Oh, Milton hidden cache. No. <clears throat> hey girl, that grumpy jerk and orca left the back door open, so I snuck in and took some stuff. I thought we might need it for when we get out of here. I can't wait to get over the mainland with you. I'm only doing this voice because it said hey girl. I can't wait to get over to the mainland with you. We can finally be together for real. I'll meet you there tomorrow night like we planned. I stash your stuff near that big fallen tree in the marshy area behind St. Christopher's. You know, where we met that one time and you drank your dad's contraband. Okay, hidden stash, excellent. Uh, so that's the big fallen tree in the marsh area behind St. Christopher's. Is that where the wolves were? Uh, 
Right, let's head back this way. During the day as well, I'll actually be able to see this time. I quite like that the music just kicks in sometimes, like when there's wide open areas and you just travel and it's pretty cool. These rocks I can pick up, yeah. Maybe that means there's rabbits over here. Like on the left here, maybe there's a few rabbits. Oh shit. Man, there's wolves everywhere. Uh, right, yeah, let me look behind the counter, because I didn't do that last time. Maybe there's something I can do here. Yeah, I, I was pitch black when I was near last time, so I didn't actually have a proper look around. I'm going to run out of space to carry. Let me look around properly first. Oh, this guy's got loads of food. What am I doing? This is why I was supposed to come here. Well, I just played this game wrong. More crackers, more food. Yeah, the fact that I came in here at night and didn't know how to work the lantern means I literally missed everything. Alright, let's leave all the stuff I have to break down for now. Let's just collect the useful stuff. So, bro, how's it going? Yeah, basically, he's got shitloads of supplies that I missed. Absolute idiot I am. But yeah, in the back as well. I've not been in the back. Look, more stuff? More? Oh my god! So this is where you were meant to get the food. This is why it's taken me so long. Because I'm an idiot. Holy shit. Oh, I'm, I'm over. I'm over encumbered again. A bedroll? Look at all this good stuff I would have had hours ago. More food, awesome. more food, go. more food. Location of emergency supplies. Ooh, even more cool stuff to find. Search the abandoned truck for emergency supplies. Uh, what does it say? Hey bud, sorry to leave you hanging like this with a storm of the power and everything, but it sounds like it's all gone to hell out of the upper bridge tonight. Car's broken down, a mess, and some rich mainlander won't budge from his truck. Probably thinks we're all a bunch of bandits waiting to rip him off, usual story. Anyway, me and Jason are going to go up there and see if we can talk some sense into him before the storm gets even worse. I'll sort you out in the morning. Thanks, Peter. Okay. Is that on my map? Uh, no, that's Grey Mother. Um, oh, there's the... Oh, ooh, ooh, there's the supplies. Uh, there's the truck. Mm, yeah, I'm getting locations to things to do now. And I can make drink some tea. Tea is really good for that and a little bit good for hunger. Nice. I also like how we can you just pick up his pot. Gear. Benefit warming up. Oh, yeah, I'm nice and warm. Improved rest. Nice. So, do the vehicles have petrol caps? Yes. But that means I can get fuel from some of them. Storm's getting pretty thick. Hopefully they've got enough food, and then we can end this session on actually having completed the mission. Which would be very good. So I've got so much now. Let's just put everything in. So I can I think I can take it out afterwards. The long winter. So I've definitely stocked her up. Let's get my hunger all the way to full. For the first time in... For the first time in forever. Right, I think I've done those challenges now. So if I talk to Grey Mother... Friend. Have you been able to remember anything else about that night? Anything that might help me find my friend? I'm back in that night. Wind howling. Voices passing through town. I can hear them. Just outside the window. It's windy. But the voices carry. They are yelling. Her voice, it passes through town. She's running. She's alone. Calling for help. But no one comes. Why didn't anyone help her? Yes. Why didn't they? They should have. Yes, they should. They should have found her before it was too late. Anything else you can remember might help. They said men came from the tunnel. What about the tunnel? The only way out of Milton. The only way through the mountains. 
It's the only way she could have gone. Oh no, not a dark, creepy tunnel. Grandmother thinks something happened at the tunnel leading out from Milton. Investigate. Shit, okay, well, I guess that's what we're doing next time. So it's the opposite way of the way I want to go to look at this thing. So, um, yeah, we might go and do... I think I'll definitely do this one. Maybe go down the road and do this one as well. Um, but this looks like that's the next objective, so... That'll do for the uh, the long dark for now. Greymother sat by a fire with a big full fridge that she didn't put any effort in for. Why don't you just give me that fucking information before? It wasn't like you were expecting me to get food for you. Give me the gun.